Hand out. 4-3. So hopefully he's going to be okay, Dasuki. Back into it, Johnny. It looks like he's okay. Oh, he's a oh what a pickup though. Hand he out. actually improvised, didn't he? His movement. He kind of held off slightly, oh. but look at this pickup. So, so powerful oh, without so too much backswing. Just making things look so easy out there. Just the accuracy levels not quite right for Gawad at this moment in time. And see he's just kind of clawing balls back. Dasuki dominating the T area. And he's just looking very smooth, Ferris Dasuki. Five, five game balls. I thought this would be game a bit ball. more of a competitive first. At the top of the team, that was uh, a very, very poor finish there from Gowad. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Again, like yesterday, he's looked back at the crowd, just asking for asking for their acknowledgement. Six one. clapping is simply not enough. Have a look at this. Suki for a two lovely, which is huge in this semi. No let. Yeah, he stitched himself, Johnny. We talked about this with Faris Dasuki. He can go and play this ball. Why does he do this? I mean, as you said, he's the one that. I mean, the and ball's right over there. The ball to level up, and the physicality starting to tell now. See the length of this second. It's been a few stop starts with decisions, but the rallies have got longer, and there's another error. 13 11, game two. So the baby faced assassin is back in this. Down. That's better. Quick fire squash, quality, ball striking. That's what we want to see, Joe. We want to see some Seven, just nine. pure squash exchanges without anything else. Yeah, I know. I mean, that's. Down. Well, he's uh, starting out. to lose Ten his head seven. a little bit for Suzuki with the scrappiness, and it's three game balls. It's been disappointing, Johnny, really, with the quality of both these guys and what we what we were promising. It, this third game's been all over the place, really. Worked that well, Gallard. He's getting the better of uh, all of this Game disruptive squash. It's worked much Gallard more in his favour. Yeah, he's, he's kept one. his concentration, showed a bit more experience and concentration. Kareem Abdul Gawad and Joey. the flying cockroaches are not a disruption to play. I would have thought that they are. <laughs> Especially if there's multiple cockroaches flying around the court. According to John Massarello, if we have an infestation, no. we just keep going. Well, I mean, even if we had uh, Godzilla and the rest of the monsters going on, you'd still be carrying on with the squash. And out. 110, match ball. Oh, what, this game has just been a complete fizzer, really. Match has had its moments, but it hasn't really met the, uh, the billing that one had hoped for prior to its begin. Suzuki has got a bit of a limp, seemingly resigns himself one. to the fact that it's all over. 
So really a uh, smooth path there for going up to some uh, tough times early on. Yeah, the baby-faced assassin didn't panic. He uh, started to knuckle down. Broke for the Suki in the end. 69 minutes, not the uh, smoothest of matches, but uh, he'll be very happy to get through and four into the final. Once again, the second time he's been in the final here in Alguna. Unbelievable pace from Moeman, the Viper. Rio. Footwork here, tremendous speed. Right there by our director. For me, that's what Moeman's got to do, Joe. He's got to really stick to basic, Seven just good four. basic squash. And that means attacking, yeah, with that speed. Moeman from deep. Oh, what a length. Unbelievable length. And I said that backhand nine. side. Moment is equal to the task. He's been allowed. sent back, but look at this volley. Hits a nick, rolls out the back. Tarek Moment takes first blood. Johnny's prediction of a, a moment upset here. A unbelievable contest. I mean, the bounding of Farag with his movement looks so strong, and the foot speed of Moment. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. He's unbelievable acceleration here, electrifying. One love. With the front foot breaking in and then the touch to hold that social Lord. awareness to know with each shot selection, just getting it right every time. And there's the sign that the world number one is completely rattled here. Seven, he is one. Right. in shock. He's trying to jog and get himself going, but deep for so long to get an opportunity like this. He's got eight game balls to go two love up. Oh, speed. And Ali Unreal. Farag's missed that. I and mean, he really had ease at sea here on the Red Sea, Ali Farag. I mean, the duration of this is so short. Tarek moment, looking fresh. Well, Farag's. Showing signs that he wants to join the party, Joey, and, and if he does, three, four. well, this could be something quite special if he would manage really length-based to get himself out of trouble, but some serious accuracy on those lengths as well. Ten, four, gimbal. So Ali Farag has responded. He's woken up. Now it's Tarek Moman that 11 5, game to Farah. softens off slightly. Lead, two games to one. So we now have uh, a fourth game coming up for you in this last semi final for the men. Some really good depth being hit by these guys, a lot of bite to it. Top. And that's well finished. Good call there from Nasser Zaran. Bang on it. Hand out 4 3. Good patience from Farag, waited, and there, nice finish. Forward area. Square. And Moment was winning when he was doing this. Hang on a minute. No, the arm, the arm from Farag. Oh! The, uh, the arm from Farag came out of nowhere, but he couldn't get that one, and there's the Yalla. Seven old. The passionate Yalla from the uh, Viper, where he throws everything into it. There. And this is a very good reaction volley with a lot Can of power. The the corner, please? I in thought he was pointing hand. at the bit of plastic. But he's talking about the pickup. I think it was okay. The one that hit the nick on mid court. I think it was all right, Johnny. Yeah, he got that clearly. Yeah, no it, was all. it was clear. Well, it was good. Well, Ali Farag sends this into Game a fifth game. Two games old. Tarek moment. Two games to love lead. And we are into that fifth. Yeah. 
And there, another fist clench. You see the determination in Ali Farag's body language. Knows the extent. That was risky. Oh, oh God, my goodness. It. Ali Farag, something's just happened to Farag. He's all Hello. over the shop. He was in control. Each player has one review available. He was in control, and he's looking at Tarek Moman. Moman. Stroke to Farag. Well, Farag Stop. gets another stroke. Backhand front corner, he's charged in, he's read it quickly. There's a review from Moment. Review for stroke decision. So he's coming, he's read this very quickly and that will be a stroke all day long. Stroke all day long, he's right on him there, Johnny. He's boasted, watch him, he's in. It's a loose ball, he's, uh, he's gonna get a stroke for this. And it is a stroke, so Ali Farag. Manages to come back from two games to love. A lot of uh, action with the referees. Huge amount of action with the referees there. But he's come back, Ali Farag, and he's fought. He had multiple match balls. He managed to convert in the tie break. So in the last match of today's play, the world number one taking on the world number three. 84 minutes, three games to two. Ali Farag into another major final. This time in Alguna, his first final. The El actually, it's his second final of the Alguna International. 